61A lecture number four. Announcements. Homework one is due tomorrow. The hog project is due next Thursday. You're meant to solve phase one of the project on your own. Then you can partner up for phases two and three. The whole project is pretty long, so get started as soon as possible. In order to encourage you to start early, I'm asking you to finish phase one by next Tuesday. If you finish before then, great. If you finish by next Tuesday, at least you'll have two more days to finish the rest of the project. We'll have a project party on Tuesday, not just about phase one, but about any part of the project, at 6.30 p.m. to 8 p.m. in Quarry Hall. If you submit the whole project by Wednesday, you get an early submission bonus point. Come to section this week to find a partner. If you don't find a partner there, we'll also have a project partner finding event next Tuesday that I'll tell you about soon. If you want more help with conceptual material, we're going to hold what's called a gorilla section. Why is it called a gorilla section? This is a moment when students descend from wherever they are on campus or wherever they are in Berkeley into a central location for an intensive period of study, and then they disperse back from whence they came, having mastered more material than they had before. These sections are not designed to help you with the project. Instead, they should help you understand the concepts in the course and get ready for the exams. These will be held in the labs in Soda Hall on Saturday, starting at noon. Next Monday is a holiday, so there will be no live lecture and there will be no lab. There will also be no office hours. However, I will publish some video-only lecture material to the course website. It's not really new material, but it does show some examples that I think will be helpful for phase two of the project and might help you discover some interesting interactions between concepts that you hadn't seen before. So I do recommend watching that video-only material on Monday or whenever you want. And if your lab is on Monday, you're still welcome to attend on Tuesday or Wednesday. We'll just try to cram some people in. If you want to complete the lab at home, that's fine too. That's true if your lab is on Monday, Tuesday, or Wednesday. Next week, if you complete the lab assignment at home and submit it, that's just as good as showing up to lab. And finally, we'll have an extra lecture this afternoon, 3 p.m. in 306 Soda Hall. Extra lectures are not extra credit. They give you nothing except for a chance to learn about something that's beyond the scope of the course. This extra lecture will be on Newton's method, which is in the textbook. It's not required that you understand Newton's method for this course, but if you want to understand it, come to the lecture. And we'll spend this week and next week learning about this interesting application of higher order functions. Higher order functions are the topic of today's lecture.